As we get older, many of us often think of what we would leave behind for our loved ones. We look over the treasures in our lives and how it will benefit our loved ones after we've passed on. Should it be the gold, the silver, the stocks, bonds, digital assets, or how about the land, the properties, the homes on which it stands? We can go on and on from considering all of the treasures in our lives, both great and small. We think about such things as we get older. But now is the time, no matter what the age, to think about what to leave behind. Not because we expect to pass on, but because we expect to move on to glory when that trumpet sounds. Amen. So this I leave behind a treasure to show my love for you. It is mine, but also shared across time throughout the ages. This treasure to leave behind, we didn't find, but he found us. This treasure will not lose value, won't rust or fade. No matter how much things change, this treasure will remain the same. This treasure we hold dearly and close to our hearts. This treasure is priceless because there was a cost involved and we couldn't pay it. And you can't steal it yet it is given away freely. This treasure will last beyond a lifetime and will guide you throughout your lifetime. This treasure is a keeper, a healer, a deliverer, and the love of your soul. The treasure is Jesus Christ, and I leave behind the love letter written to all of mankind, the Bible. Therein, an invitation to a restored relationship with God and a defined purpose for your life. Because your life means something and it's extremely important. So when the time comes, I will leave the best part of me. I want to encourage you to embrace the treasure and the map to it.